What? Do you want to go out? <laughs> yeah. Okay, let's go. Let's go. about me, but rather a vlog centered around my main girl, Nikki, right here. Now, I maybe shouldn't necessarily say vlog, but I will be trying to post some kind of video each day. I may miss a few, but I'm gonna try. It's tough to post every day. It takes time to edit, but it's something I really, really wanna do because Nikki's not doing too well. Back in June of last year, it was revealed that Nikki had developed cancer. She's 12, almost 13, and uh, it's pretty normal for dogs to grow bumpy. She also had developed growths inside her intestine and colon, tumors, and they were preventing her from having bowel movements. She would try to go, but she just struggled, and it was tough to watch. Now, we could have had them removed, but my dad didn't want to because a friend of Nikki's also had some tumors removed, but it actually made things worse. The vet gave her like a month, a month. Now, obviously she's still here, but I wasn't when this happened. I was living in Los Angeles when I found out. And with a few other circumstances, I decided to come home and see my girl, Nikki. We weren't even sure she'd make it by the time I drove back home, but she did. And it was such a sight to see her. <laughs> you know, FaceTime is nice, but it's not even close to actually being there. I imagined it being like one of those, uh, those soldiers returning home to their dog just uncontrollably hugging and jumping all over them. But uh, no, Nikki was not like that at all. She gave me a sniff, one kiss, only one, took a pee and then went and laid down in the yard. That's okay though, she knew her boy was home. So now it's February and she's still here. We didn't think she would be, but we sure ain't complaining. One thing we did was instead of feeding her once a day at dinner time, we uh, split it up throughout the day. So it wasn't so much for her at once. And it helped. She still had some trouble, but we, we didn't see nearly the struggle she was having before. But with her age comes some other issues. Very recently, she's been having accidents inside the house. I wouldn't say she's fully incontinent, but she's getting there. She also drinks way more water than she used to, which I've heard that means that the liver is probably shutting down or something. It's not good. Either way, it should be evident that this daily video will come to an inevitable end. The last one being Nikki's last day. I've always hated thinking about that day. And I don't know when that day will be, but in the meantime, I'm hoping to catch some quality moments with her. So if you wanna follow along, go ahead and subscribe and even share this video with someone you think might be interested. But I suggest you turn on notifications because I'm probably gonna be posting sporadically. Most will be uploaded late at night. But that's the end of today's video and maybe we'll see you tomorrow. We're we gonna see them tomorrow. Say bye. Bye bye.